Hello and welcome back to Chirfilpi. And we ran into a situation here. Eh. What's going on here? Fuck all to do with you. Piss off. Lady doesn't feel like talking to you. I can handle this. Shut your trap. Hmm. I can make him leave. I'm lost. Is he in the scenario? Scenario. Stop spoiling our fun, all right? Oh, great. Oh, this gets completely blown the move for me. Let me get out of your way. Just maybe find some place a little more secluded. <laughs> uh, false alarm, I guess. False alarm happens. Unless, you know, just uh, way out and trying to find some place to repair and sell my weapon resources. <laughs> I don't know, I ran into this. Yeah, getting out of that place was pretty simple, but I just needed to, you know, climb on the cupboard and uh, get over the top. Seemingly the uh, floor in the renderer quite quite right and I fell down took a bit of damage other than that that was fine what's going on here excuse me someone makes bruise for him as do I. White one. Excuse me. No dealings with my I swear, get out of this some wizardry, me old life. Doesn't seem like we can interfere in here in any way. Scrum for I give me a name. Then I'll release you. Don't you? Don't know any mages. But surely you know someone who does. You can either help willingly or up to torture. Duke. Alright, this seems to be going on the same all over again. Ah, uh, well, I tried. I really tried. Mm. Ah, uh, well. I actually need to look into something else. Like some contract or something. Or oh, really, of all the city things. Oh, wait a second. What's going on here? Avoid doing business with dwarven scum. What's the problem? Fuck! Another non-human! You're everywhere! Silence! Now we'll do this quick. I've got a little witcher chore. You willing? Little chores aren't usually worth the pay. <laughs> well, this will be, don't you, Fred? Now just be quick about it. I've wasted enough time on these two pricks. They share a warehouse. Monsters cropped up in it. Cropped up? On its own? You put it there. You meant it to rip my noodle off so you could get your paws on my goods. Don't uh -huh. try to spin this, shorty. <laughs> I don't care who shook the ghoul or the strigger on who. Beast's got to be dealt with. That's that. So what'll it be, would ya? Well, if it pay... Fine. I'll see to it. I'll not have it. Non-humans, they stick together. These two are like to prove it's no ghoul at all, but my dear departed Nan. I didn't get a good look at the mug, but now you mention it, it could very well be. Shut it, or I'll send inspectors to your storehouse just as soon as the monster's dispatched. That won't be necessary. Eh. Well, that healed a bit of her anxiety. Okay, where is that? Oh, that's the wrong, uh, wrong quest. Warehouse of Woe. Sure. Okay. Let's look around in here. Alright. Nothing that I was looking for was here. Then. 
<laughs> really beats me. Well, I guess this warehouse is bigger than I thought. Or I'm at the wrong warehouse. <laughs> One of the two. Let's go kill some monsters. No, I work alone, dude. <laughs> and you're too small for that. And not prepared and uh, everything else. Wait a second. What do you mean locked? Uh, have I been on the wrong thing all, all the way? I guess so. Should I'm supposed to find some shortcut here? This is the, the address. Oh, hi. It's the Necker? What the Necker is doing in the middle of a city, damn it. Well, strange. Neckers rarely venture anywhere alone. Ah, yeah, that that too. <laughs> Someone may as well have dragged him in there. Hmm. Someone kept it in a cage. Hmm. Bars were sawed through. That's why it escaped. Okay. Mm, somebody had a pet and somebody decided to make a joke. Uh, hmm. Guess that's about it. Alright. Uh! Have something to say. <laughs> so, you take care of the beast? Of a beast? Yes. Yes. I knew Aaron which would be quickest. So figure out how we got in there. Well, found a cage. Found a cage. Someone had kept the necker in it. Bars had been sawed through though. So someone wanted it to escape. Which one of them did it? Found no evidence pointing either way. Ha! No one wants evidence. If neither confesses, we'll lock them both up for obstructing a guard investigation. Thanks for your help. Here's your pay. Come on. Yeah. Seems fair. And we sure got paid. Happy ending. <laughs> I could say that again. Alright. Hey, actually even uh, decent pay for one necker. Some other objective, even if my inventory is. Damn, my inventory is bad. <laughs> I need to find a merchant. Uh, Top notch swords? Yeah, whatever. Show me what you have in stock. Maybe you have some interesting things. Okay, nope. Nope. Definitely not. Well, that's slightly more interesting. I guess we may as well buy it. Just two percenters. Probably definitely got those other things before the patch. Assassin trouser. But if uh, twice less health bonus. Hey, this is actually better version of my armor. What do you know? No assassin boots are not as good. But the gauntlets, it's a different story. Get the stun rune in. Poison rune in and the freeze rune in. Yeah, we may as well I think use this as a 5% bonus, yeah. But we need to upgrade. I mean, Equip it to to upgrade. Four hundred twenty one thirty seven twenty one still. That's weird. 
I guess the UI is still not showing the right values in the damage department. Ah, uh, crap. Oh uh, well. Let's put the burn rune and the stagger rune. Suppose it is better. Even if uh, UI is not saying uh, the improvement is being made. Should be made. Okay. I wasted on this long enough. Good folk! Mages have set the hunters out of play. They seek to burn the city down! Yeah, yeah, right, right. Don't fret about it. Yeah, we should just look into some points of interest, I think. Aha. Okay. We reached the place. The build shack. That's something uh, a little bit more dangerous. Aha. I guess I should uh, get uh, East Theory Wives. Uh, hags. Yeah, hags are uh, necrophages. May as well get the enchant necrophage oil. Aha. Now it's much better. Aha. Yeah. Mm. Ow. Still heal me. Yeah. Just to be sure. out of water. It's time for that. Yeah, it has too easy time here in the swamps. To hug. <laughs> Got the mutagen for deconcoction. Crossbow, cavalry boots, superior saddle. Well, not exactly what I needed. Let's look into crossbow. No, not really on par. Cavalry boots. Well, good coincide intensity. Haven't expected that. Not bad armor rate. But armor piercing is really huge, as well as the slots. So to speak. Well, we tried. And about the saddle, yeah, that's not even close. Oh well. Still gonna be a nice selling. So to speak. 
What else is in the vicinity? Yeah, we're quite a few villages and uh, a few points of interest around. I may as well check out the new village. I've been, you know, hanging out in Novigrad and surrounding areas for like a you know, bunch of episodes. <laughs> 20 or so. Come on. May as well check out some new places. Hey, that's a trialing trader. Greetings. Farewell. And who else is in the area? I know this board. Always nice. And... Something is abound here as well. What's going on here? What's the problem? Oh, nothing. On your way now, good man. Shut it, got out. He could help. Little Red's band means to attack the village. Want revenge on Bertram. We haven't much, but we're willing to pay if you defend us. Uh... Who is Little Red? Who's Little Red? Word is she fornicates with wolves and can tear a man apart with her bare mitts. A she-beast in human husk. Though some call her a great beauty. She leads a pack of deserters. True dregs from different armies. The kind what knows killing and plundering well. <laughs> Red little riding hood. Lol. Okay, why do we want revenge? Why does this band want revenge on you of all people? Cause... Cause I ratted on them to the witch hunters. Witch hunters care about bandits? Since when? Little Red's band. They was terrorizing our village. We had none to defend us. Finally Bertram went by the hunters, asked them. So the hunters went after him. We had a spell of peace, but now Little Red's learnt of it all. Wants to kill Bertram. He's done for if you don't help. Yeah, let's look into his deal. Fine. I'll handle the bandits. Go to your homes, bar the doors. Beware of them, Witcher. They're the dangerous type, truly. Witcher's coming. Okay. Wait until dusk for Little Red's band to attack. Alright. Oh, you know. Set an ambush here. <laughs> or a red Jenny. Or little red. <laughs> Whoever. Okay. How did it say? Dusk. Okay, got it. Dusk it is. Mm hmm. So, equip the potions, the more commonly used. Yeah, Northern Wind, Grape Shot, seems fine. There's the bombs. Okay. See what's up. It's almost dusk. Almost. Huh. Oh, Witcher, did the villagers hire you? Hmm. They did, to defend them from monsters, and humans who can be monsters. And you believe me to be such? Are you? Find out for yourself if you dare, or give me Bertram. No one else will get hurt. What did he do to you? What did Bertram do to you to warrant vengeance? But, mean they didn't mention this bit? Then listen. He came to me a half year back. Said he'd point out who's worth looting in return for a share of the takings. But sometime on, the bugger grew greedy. He wanted more. I refused. That's when he set the witch hunters on us. Lost half me men cause of him. Now step aside, Witcher. This ain't your affair. We want Bertram, 
No one else. Give my word. Well, I don't know. I guess the guy asked for it. I mean, he betrayed the villagers himself. Uh, hmm. Well, let's see. I won't get in your way. Do what you gotta. Right decision, Witcher. Ah uh, well. See, quick and painless. That's for you, for understanding. <sighs> Let's go, gents! Welp. That ended. Is it the bandits you witches work for now? You go here. Piss off now. now! What do you want? Kill you my ass. Great. What do you want? Being a priest. That's a so good sir. <laughs> Not happy about that. Ah, uh, well. Obviously, we don't care about that guy, actually. Was one of the bandits almost. Ah, oh, great. Okay, Phantom. Let's look into that. Contract. Here we go. Happy about that. And how's the work going? Preparing for the harvest and all that, eh? Harvest? In springtime? Now, why'd I be doing that, sir? Well, what are you doing in the fields then? We're fixing to gather fruit from the bushes. Ah, apples, right? Never mind. <laughs> Nothing to look at there. Where is this place that you're really? Honey fill meadows. Well, guess Roach is a safe bet. It's pretty far away. Let's go. Guy is a blacksmith. Maybe we can. Uh... What's new in the broad? Oh, or maybe not. <laughs> I just assumed. It was not safe to assume. Oh well. Seems to be a place. There's a bunch of bees around. You flee to Maria too. For lunch and today. Here. Welcome to Honeyview Tower. Uh, seems to be a whole family. Mm. Mm-hmm. Olafurnus Meyersdorf at your service. Meet my sons, Bernie, Franklin, and Hugo. Hmm. Any relation to Rico Meyersdorf? Uh, uh, yes. My youngest son. Sadly, he fled the family business. Went to seek fortune in the big city. Huh? Why do you ask? Do you know him? <laughs> well, well yeah. yeah, we've met. But that's not why I'm here. 
came about the notice you posted. It's the Apiarian Phantom. It's ravaging my hives. Let's talk about the reward first. As far as my reward's concerned. Yeah, let's try... Like... That much. Hmm... Honeyfill's not been generating the revenues of old since the Phantom appeared. Would you be willing to reduce your price? Hmm... About that much? Oh, as you wish. Fail to rid us of the Phantom and we'll go belly up anyway. I shall look upon your fee as an investment. So it's a deal? It is. It is. Can you describe such phantom? Huh? You do realize this apiarian phantom. Well, there is no such thing. Huh? It's a monster, gotta be. A wraith, maybe. Any of your workers see anything? I did. I was cleaning a hive when I heard a farmhand cry out. Screamed as though he'd been stung by a whole swarm all at once. I ran to him, but he was dead. Any stings on him? None. He looked like he had frostbite, blue lips, frost in his hair, and dead bees lay all around him. Hmm. Farmhand who died, what did you do with the body? Wouldn't mind a look. Too late for that. We buried the poor fellow a few days back. Oh well. Where'd the phantom appear? Can any of you show me? I'll go. Come with me. Alright, lead the way. Follow me. Where do you get the idea that it was an apiarian phantom? Mm. It's a beekeeping superstition. We mismanage the bees' offerings, the phantom appears. He destroys the eyes and kills the bees, so that no one can use these noble creatures for ignoble purpose. Sick to your bees on the competition. Mm. No, father recently signed a contract with the Redanians. So the phantom's from Nilfgaard. Uh huh. Oh, interesting. This is the place. Here's where the phantom killed the farmhand. Maybe it left some tracks. Now let's look into it. Looks like tracks. The Aryan Phantom's got large feet. Uh huh. And it's pretty damn heavy. Covered in frost. Cold must have killed the bees. Quiet. Blood. Dried and blackened, so several days old. Must be where the farmhand died. Hmm. Wonder where these clues will lead me. Uh. Tracks disappear in the water. Doubt anything's hiding in this puddle they call a lake. Need to check the other side, see if the trail goes on. Oh well. It's never easy. Mm -mm. Let's do it. Nothing around here. Not that I can see. Whoa. Could be anywhere. Ah, oh, great. That's a big draw now. Nasty. Ha. Ha. Come on. Show me your best. <laughs> Too slow. Not 
Nice. Nice and painful. <laughs> okay. Hey, got some red mutagen. May start crafting, you know, better uh, red mutagens. Improve our attack potential. Okay. Need to, just in case, put them some oils. Alright, and uh, let's keep searching. Must be around the shore somewhere. Must be. Although this is a bit far to look for it. Yeah, that's a bloody big circle to look into. Assumption was on your side, but uh, could be anywhere around, I guess. As well. Show you the drowners, but they didn't destroy the hives. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Not their profile. <laughs> Damn it. Shit. Come on, hit me. Ah, you're disappointing me. <laughs> in a while. <laughs> That's about time. Pond, and I'll show you no more red material for me. That's a bit better. Either ki kill them quick or have to, you know, dance around a lot. Oh well. Yeah, no luck. No luck here. Well, we got the tracks down. But we still wanna, you know, get my red material back. I can't hope. <laughs> Really need those, just so we can kill them faster. Oh come on, not the bloody combo again. Come on.
I got the red mutagen. Good. And another one. And you know what that means? It means we can actually craft. Get the mutagen out. In there. Now alchemy. Red mutagen. 7%. Character again. Back to the mutagen. Got 8% damage boost. It's pretty good. Also save. <laughs> That's all better. Also necrophage oil. No. Oh. Retribution is coming. <laughs> Thanks for healing. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, come on. Cereal. Ah, uh, oh well. Really need my drowner timing back. Lost it somewhere along the path. <laughs> ah, man. <clears throat> come on, I'm Witcher. I need to, you know. Psych up. Psych up. Uh. Squeeze through here. Gotta find another way in. Oh well. Yeah. In the basement. through here. That's what like normal people. <laughs> Come on, what seems to be a problem? Locked. <laughs> it's locked. Um I got the key right here. The father began building this house for Bernie, but ran out to coin. It's been standing half finished since. Wonderful hiding place for whatever destroyed your hives. I'm going in. You go home and bar your door. Who knows what might come out of there. Well noticed. Almost messed up with a drowner. No need to mess up with something else. Bigger. So to speak. Wait. Where is the bloody button? The Aerium Phantom Maya. Oh wow. It's a hound of the wild hunt. How the hell did it end up here? Hey, where are you going? Roach will run you down. Come on. Come on, yeah. Yeah, well, the frost is kind of, you know, their thing. Yeah. Should I try hit it? Probably. <laughs> How about that? Not that easy. <laughs> Come on. Doesn't want to engage whatsoever. Nobody can hit each other. Okay, I'm serious. Two. 
Ne. Okay. Um, am I missing something here? <laughs> I may be missing something big here. <laughs> Roach will, uh, Roach will run you down. Blah. <sighs> I wouldn't really put it that way. Let's <laughs> just say. This bloody door is not even opening, damn it. Eh. In the basement. Come on. Oh shit. Well, now we avoided that BS. <laughs> Just say that much. Yeah! Well, that's a simpler way to do it. Just not to let get away in the first place. <laughs> A trophy. Hmm. Still a weird place to encounter such a beast in here. Alone. Hmm. He must have lost his pack somewhere. <laughs> Along the way. What does the trophy do? Additional chance to find herbs. XP is probably more worth it. Oh well. So I take care of your problems. Time to pay up. <laughs> your Apiarian phantom was a hound of the wild hunt. Eternal fire! Hounds run with the wild hunt as well. About two weeks back, I woke suddenly in the night, saw the hunt streaking across the sky. Hound must have gotten separated then. Couldn't go back, so it hid in the empty house. It's hardly compensation for your losses, but at least the Hound won't destroy any more hives. Thank you, Witcher. It's true. Nothing like hiring a specialist. Oh, All right. Today, boys. Let's go home. A big day tomorrow. Let's rebuild the hive the Hound destroyed. Work and more work. Yeah, still, what kind of uh, oils I should uh, use against these guys? Elementa ones. Hmm. Got it. Bomb, Igni, and Axie signs. Okay, makes sense. Keep that in mind. Okay. Yeah, I think, you know, this is gonna be a good enough place to cut episodes. I hope you enjoyed this one. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye, guys.